Hi students, welcome to Justin NCRT Solutions. In this video, we are going to see 600 Maths Chapter 3 Exercise 3.5 Second question. We are going to find factor 3 for the given value 60. First, we are going to separate the 60 into two numbers. 6 into 10. 6 tens are 60. And here 6 is not a prime number. So again we are going to separate the 6. One number is 2. So 2 3s are 6. 2 is a prime number and 3 also prime number. Next we are going to separate this 10. 10 is not a prime number. So we are going to separate 5. One number they found it 5. 5 2s are 10. 5 is a prime number. 2 also prime number. <coughs> Now, 60 is given. Now, we are going to separate in another one method. 30 and another one number. We don't know this number. But 30, 2's are 60. 2 is a prime number. 30 is not a prime number. So, now we are going to separate 10 into 3. 10, 3's are 30. 3 is a prime number. 10 is not a prime number. So, we have to separate this. Now, 5, 2's are 10. 5 is the prime number, 2 also prime number. So now we are going to check it. 2 into 5, 2 into 3 into 5 into 2 is equal to 2, 3's are 6, 6, 5's are 30, 32's are 60. We are getting that answer. Now we are going to check this side. <coughs> 5 into 2 into 3 into 2 is equal to 5 2s are 10, 10 3s are 30, 30 2s are 60. So in this sum, we saw that factor 3 for 60 in both methods we saw part A, part B. In part A, 6 into 10, then 6 we are separating again 2 into 3, then 10, 5 into 2. Next sum, in part B, we are separating 30 into 2. Then this 30 we are separating 10 into 3. Then this 10 we are separating 5 into 2. So both also we are getting same prime numbers. So this is called prime factorization. Okay, that's all students. Kindly give your suggestions in the comments box. And share this video to your friends. And subscribe our channel. Thank you.